Welcome to my channel. Please enjoy the video. So it seems that Leticia Mather has proven that she is in fact Jay-Z's daughter. And guys, her DNA results are in. Jay-Z's alleged daughter Leticia Mather says that she has the DNA proof. She is in fact his daughter says Macer. And as we all know guys, Ramirez Satherwhite claimed that Jay-Z is his father as well. And Jay-Z had been avoiding taking the DNA test for many years. So let me tell you guys allegedly how Leticia Macer obtained the DNA test. She didn't do it through Jay-Z the rapper either. She did it through DNA ancestry. And she in factly, indeedly matched with his grandmother. Now guys, if you're wondering where I've been, I've been trying to get in contact with Leticia Macer, but it seems that she locked her Instagram page down. However, I did send her a DM and I asked her if she would like to come on my YouTube channel and explain to us exactly the steps she took but she didn't respond back. However guys, the names that are attached to the receipts in this video are in factly indeed people related to Sean Carter. And this is why it took so long for me because I had to do more digging and more investigation before I even put this information out. Hattie White is indeed in factly Jay-Z's grandmother. Leticia Macer's DNA was linked to Jay-Z's grandmother and his aunt. And we all know because Jay-Z put it out that Hattie White is in fact his grandmother. And me as a YouTube blogger and my last name being White, I wouldn't even care to know if Jay-Z was related to me or not. He's going to do his thing and I'm definitely going to do mine. But we're talking about Leticia Macer. Leticia Macer posted a video edit showing what she claimed to be a DNA test of her relationship with Jay-Z. And she says that she won't stop talking about Jay-Z until he takes up his responsibility as being her father. And guys, let me make one thing perfectly clear. An Ancestry DNA is the newest DNA test and it helps you find out your genetic relatives and expand your genealogy research. You could possibly link your DNA to other relatives on both sides of your mother or your father. So if your parents are not in the system, System and you're doing research to find your ancestry DNA and it seems this is what Leticia Macer did and like I said guys she did it through DNA ancestry and according to her IG page she has decided to speak her truth she also alleges that the rapper music mogul Sean Carter aka Jay-Z is in fact her father and I've personally known people who have done the ancestry test and those ancestry tests are 100% on point. So if her DNA results link back to Jay-Z's grandmother, then he is in fact her father. The end of the story. And remember guys, Jay-Z stated that he did not know Ramir and he was not even related to Ramir. And he denied having any relationship with Wanda. But y'all see that receipt I dropped a couple of days ago. Him hugged that with Wanda in the corner. So now guys, can we possibly assume that there is smoke to that fire as well? And most of all to these two children that claim to be his children. Now that we prove that Jay-Z in fact had something going on with Wanda because they were on the photo together. And in my opinion, this young lady is from Cambridge, Merlin, and that's where Jay-Z's stomping grounds was back in the day. And in my opinion, I really believe that this is too far-fetched to just be a rumor or just an allegation. Because remember guys, as we say on the Sweet Tea TV YouTube channel, where there's smoke, there's definitely some goddamn fire. Now guys, people are asking me in my inbox, do I believe the story that Leticia Mather is in fact Jay-Z's daughter? And I'm going to state how I feel about the whole situation because DNA does not lie and neither does looks. Take for instance guys, Kathy White, she was going to come out and do a tell-all book. She was going to spill the beans on her and Jay-Z's relationship and affair. Just one week later, she ends up dead. Jay-Z has been avoiding Ramir for eight years. Avoiding taking a paternity test. If you're not the dad, take the paternity test and send him on his way. Ramir Carr gets shot up. Ramir almost lost his life. And this lady claiming to be Jay-Z's first daughter? She hasn't said a word in almost a year. And let's not forget Chanel Scott. Her father-in-law recanted his whole story and said that he misspoke. There's a lot of strange things going on with Jay-Z at this moment, guys. If you don't believe me, just do the research. It's all there. Everybody who's came out and spoke against Jay-Z and tried to expose him, they've either been killed or silenced in some type of way. Some possibly even paid off to shut their mouths. Leticia Mason was born and raised in Cambridge, Maryland. Jay-Z was in Cambridge, Maryland around that time. And we all know, Jay-Z lied about Wanda. We can clearly see that with the photo. Jay-Z and Beyonce just had twins. This lady that's claiming to be Jay-Z's daughter gave birth to twins as well. Now let's break down the ancestry facts of Latissa Mesa's ancestry DNA test. Proof number one, her relation to Arissa White. Proof number one, her relationship to Arissa White. Arissa White is Jay-Z's cousin. Leticia did an Ancestry.com match to find out who she's related to. And these results indeed show that she matched to Arissa White by 80%. 
On Ancestry, when two people have a DNA match, this means that they both have inherited DNA from one or more ancestors. And if you guys take a look at the receipt above, it shows that she indeed matched with Arissa. And after matching, she did reach out to Arissa for some help. She stated in her text, Arissa, I need your help. Arissa stated back, Hi Leticia, I don't know how I can be of help, but what questions do you have? And honey, this does not sound like someone who was openly and happy about somebody matching to their DNA ancestry. On the count of Jay-Z, of course. Proof number two, her relation to another cousin of Jay-Z's, Belinda Parker. Leticia also reached out to Belinda Parker as well. And Belinda Parker stated to her, I haven't really kept in touch with that side of my family. All of the cousins that were my age, they grew up and they've died. Well, Jay-Z and his brother, Eric, is very much alive, Belinda. And I'm sure you possibly know that, for a fact. Well guys, it's clearly obvious that she has tried reaching out to Jay-Z's family members. And one thing's for sure guys, her DNA matched to Jay-Z's grandmother and his cousin. So let me know what you guys think. Do you think that this is Jay-Z's daughter? And do you guys really believe that Ramirez is his son as well? Drop it down in the comment section. Please like the video, subscribe, share the video, hit the notification bell, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.